What is poppin' him a choppin' my bagel bites? It is Mr. Bagel Bites here bringing you some VGC 2021 content. Bet you didn't think you would hear that again. It has been a minute. I was watching a Cybertron video and I saw him play against a team similar to this and I was just inspired to make a video with it because I think hail's probably my favorite weather, but it's just kind of really bad. So I never get to use it, but I love the idea of the team and uh, really want to try and do something with it myself. He's got some interesting Pokemon over there, so uh, we'll, we'll have to play it a little, a little different here than I want to. No restricted, which is surprising. We're going to bring Kiram and lead Gothitelle with it. I think it's a really strong lead because they can't swap out against Kiram. Kiram hits really hard. We're choice scarfs, so we're outspeeding a lot of the metagame, which is good. I, I use Urshifu. I think he I think the team that I saw it had like uh, Moltres and I forget the other slot um, But I opted for Urshifu and Suicune Mostly because I think they just fill some niches that are a little bit better I'm gonna bring Abomasnow in the back. Vested Abomasnow is actually pretty nutty <laughs> I think it's really good uh, for the final slot. I think I am gonna bring Suicune I think it potentially matches up against a lot of their Pokemon really well and uh, Let's see what happens. I am so rusty. This is my first game not on Showdown. I did do a couple games on Showdown last night to like prep for the team and then spent the rest of the day after work making this, but I'm super excited to get back into VGC content, and if you're excited, make sure you hit that like, subscribe button, stay up to date. If this video hits 30 likes, I'll go ahead and paste, uh, post the Poke Paste and the uh, rental code for this team down below in the comments and on Twitter, so make sure you check out for those. I didn't see a way to set weather on his team, but I'm going to be honest, I wasn't super checking. Yeah, I didn't think so. Unless Jolteon learns Rain Dance and I'm just wrong, but I feel like it doesn't. I'm kind of, I'm kind of thinking just like swapping in a bomb of snow, but I'm I kind of want to scout the Rain Dance. Uh, he could protect here. I think I'm gonna Helping Hand and go for Freeze Dry because I don't think Jolteon does anything to us honestly, and potentially if he doesn't have the. Okay, so there's the Helping Hand. I also love that there's... Oh, what am I thinking? I was actually kind of hoping... <laughs> yeah, this is how rusty I am, if you couldn't tell. I, did, I didn't even think about Fake Out. Substitute. He gets to Substitute up for free now, which kind of sucks. But I don't think it has any setup. Um, I'm going to go ahead and Taunt here into the Ludicolo. No, actually, I know what I'm going to do. I'm actually going to Psychic here in case it's Sashed. And then I'm going to go ahead and Earth Power the Jolteon. Since we didn't get locked into Freeze Dry, we can still go ahead and attack here. So we'll get this off. That looks really sweet. I haven't played an online match in so long. Substitute Faded. Shadow Ball. Okay. Uh, I think we're going to actually eat that. Goth uh, Gothitelle is so bulky. Yeah, we eat that pretty well. It does have Rain Dance. I thought so. So we can actually play into that next turn, which will be pretty sweet. If we want. So we'll go ahead and potentially break the Sash here. He still can't swap out because it got the tail. Is Rain Dish not Swift Swim? And Lefties? Okay. I wasn't expecting that. Interesting. Uh, yeah, I think I am going to go ahead and swap to the Abomasnow Snow here. Because it can take both their hits pretty well. Uh, yeah, we're locked in, right? <laughs> I was about to say, we are Scarfed, right? Um, I think we just Earth Power here, honestly. Yeah, I don't see a reason not to go ahead and just swap here, change the weather. Obama Snow with the vest going to be able to take anything they can do. Especially if that is bulky booty colo. And it is shiny. I get to show my shiny Obama Snow. Obama Snow is probably one of my favorite mon that are just really bad. Because ice and grass typing together is just abysmal. Scarf coming out here. Clutch. Picking up the KO on Jolteon. Sweet. So let's pick up one KO. And then he scalds me. Giga Drain. Alright, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna eat that right up. So we may need to swap out Kiram here. Uh, he's gonna take some chip damage there. Which is offset by his. I think it was lefties he was holding, wasn't it? Yeah, sweet. Interesting team. Now we have uh I might actually swap them both out, reading the the obstruct from the obstagoon here. Do we just blizzard anyway? 
Hmm. We have Suicune in the back, right? Um, I think I'm gonna... I think I'm gonna swap to Gothitel here. I might double swap. Mostly because I don't want... Kiram out with, with Earth Power. And then if he rain dances here, we're in a bad position. So I'm gonna swap in Suicune into the Kiram slot. Suicune's really bulky. Uh, and then Abama Snow can come back too. Into Gothitel that traps him next turn. If as long as they don't KO here. Yep, predicting the obstruct. I thought so. So now that'll be bad next turn. And he goes for Surf. Okay, that shouldn't do a ton. Suicune's gonna take like nothing. That may even proc our berry from uh from Gothitel. Uh, I think it's gonna miss out on just a bit. The hail might put us in range though. That'd be pretty sick. Okay, that potentially breaks the sash on Obstagoon if he was holding it. It's gonna put us at 50, 47. Procs the lefties. Okay, so I guess that didn't get our berry proc, which is kind of unfortunate. Oh, okay, it's guts. Here. Um, Obstagoon's pretty fast. I'm pretty fine going for Protect here. I'm running Roar. Um, we don't need Tailwind. We're in a pretty advantageous spot. We could Snarl. Um, God, it might be better to let Gothitelle go down here, actually. I'm going to Tailwind. Oh, wait, no. Oh, I forgot to... I messed up. I actually don't know what Gothitelle did now. <gasps> okay, yeah, let's Protect. I kind of wanted Gothitelle to go down here. Um, but it's fine. We can... Yeah, that's fine. We burn another turn of hail. I mostly want to save it to try and maximize our hail turns. So I can just swap in and just double, uh, Blizzard. Suicune's gonna take this... Okay, it takes it fairly well. Uh, we're also safety goggles, Suicune. With Roar. Got to tell take some. Is that berry range? Okay, yeah. So if we swap in, we're gonna get knocked off. They'll take some burn damage and hail, so that's going to be good. Ludicolo, okay, so... Obstagoon's faster than Ludicolo, then Suicune. I really love Suicune. And then there's the burn damage. Sweet. Every bit helps. How many turns of hail left? Two. I miscounted. I don't want to swap in Kiram. Actually, we can now since we set up... I guess we don't... Yeah, actually, I guess we don't need... The scarf. I just hate taking that much damage since we have Tailwind up now. Because the knockoff's definitely going in this slot. Maybe it's better to go Obama Snow. What's your defense? 95 versus 111. Um, still can't swap. I'm gonna swap to Obama Snow here. No, I'm actually, yeah, I am gonna let the Gothitelle go down. I'm gonna go for. Man, this stinks. Psychic and a Snarl to start weakening that Ludicolo. Oh, okay. So we are faster now. Get a little chip damage on the Obstagoon. Pokato chip. Shout out. And then get the Psychic off too. Wow, Gothitelle outspeed with, with Tailwind up. That's pretty incredible. <gasps> Facade coming out here. Probably going to take down Suicune. Oh, we're actually probably going to get double KO'd then. Oh, please don't... Okay, Giga Drain. Uh, with a minus one, Gothitelle definitely lives this. We have one turn of hail left. Correct? Yes, sweet. That is exactly what we needed to happen there. And then... Ludicola. Sweet. So now we can switch in with Blizzard. He still hasn't rain dance. That's actually pretty interesting. <laughs> Ah, uh, yeah, so we can swap in Kiram here. I think it's a good position, too. They're definitely going to outspeed between Choice Scarf. We have Turbo Blaze, which is such a good ability, too. Um, I am going to Helping Hand here and just Blizzard and just lock into Blizzard. <laughs> I don't see any reason not to. I think this probably just KOs both, honestly, with Helping Hand and Hail Up. Don't hold me to that. Does Blizzard and Hail break through Protect like Thunder in Rain? I don't actually remember. It's been a minute. I'm a little rusty. I just absolutely love how Kiram looks like in the Hail too, like with fused with uh, Reshiram. I think between the two, aesthetically, Zekrom looks better, but it's definitely really cool. 
Because now they can't... They still can't swap out. They don't protect. Here comes a big damaging move. Yeah, we're going to pick up two KOs. Yeah. So we got the berry proc correct, so we should be pretty good on... Oh. We don't even need the health, because the uh, hail stops here. So he is going to probably bring in... I don't know what would be his last month, Cinderace. Okay, that's fair. Really bad matchup versus Obama Snow. Um, we definitely have speed with Kiram. Obama Snow, I doubt. I could just swap here anyway. How many turns of Tailwind do we have left? Wait a second. If it's two, it's one. Okay. Do we want to be locked into Blizzard? We have Earth Power. I'm going to stay in with Gothitelle. I'm going to go for Protect here. I think. I could Chip. It could be Sash. That's true. I didn't think about it being Sash. I'm going to Psychic here into Cinderace, and then I'm actually going to swap into a Bomb Snow to reset the hail in case it's Sashed and reset our Choice Scarf. Yeah, I think that's the best play. Because either something gets KO'd here, or we get a free swap, and then I can just Earth Power. And we're for sure breaking the Sash if it exists. I think that's the best play overall. High Jump Kick, miss. High Jump Kick, miss. Nope, no miss. A Bomb still probably going down here. Yeah. Not surprising. Show me Life Orb or Sash. Nope, but we do get the chip damage. This is probably a two-hit KO. Yeah. He doesn't have any spread moves. Yeah, because he turned himself into a fighting type. Tailwind petered out. That's fine. Because now we can swap to Kiram in the hail. Um, Sucker Punch crit, I guess, is his best bet. Might KO Kiram. I'm just going to Helping Hand and Earth. There's no way to avoid Blizzard. I'm just... Yeah, I'm just clicking Blizzard. Yeah, we win. If he has Protect, I guess that's worst case. But we might find out if it breaks through. That'll be cool information. Oh yeah, we just... Yeah, he's a fighting type, so this'll just do good damage. Sweet. We take game one. We're back on the ladder, baby. We're 100% win ratio right now. I really like this team. Let me know if you guys like this team or any suggestions. I'm super out of the metagame. Um... I've, I've been I've kept up very little uh, okay it's fine so let me let me know what you guys think down below if you think there could be any improvements or any suggestions because uh and let me know if you want to see more VGC content I felt like that was a thing that people wanted to see it definitely was the more viewed content on the channel before I kind of like stepped away from YouTube for a while so uh yeah definitely let me know down below I'm gonna use Calyrex because Alorex is ice horse and everyone loves ice horse and we are using Ice Team with Ice Horse. No, we're actually not using Ice Horse. I'm a liar. But I really love Reshiram. Remember to stay hydrated. Go ahead and take your designated water break now. Ooh, <laughs> is this literally the rented uh, the rented water team? That's sick. Pelipper. I'm kind of fine with same lead. Like, right? Our, our team is actually really good against this. I, um... Yeah, I'm pretty fine with Gothitelle, Kiram lead, a Bomb Snow in the back for weather control, and then really Suicune and Zapdos both feel really good here. Zapdos, well... Not, not great, I guess. Is Suicune better here because it has Snarl? No, they have like three big counters to it. Maybe even Urshifu is almost better in that regard. For how do we beat Therathorn? Kiram. Um, I think I'm gonna bring Zapdos. I think Zapdos is pretty good here, because if we can keep Gothitelle in, swap in the Zapdos, and they can't swap in their Raichu, Zapdos might just sweep. I feel like it does, honestly. I need to update my trainer card. That's an old outfit. I think I'm wearing the, the blue aesthetic. Yeah, so they're just leading with the rain. Yeah, the blue. Okay. Um, so we have Turbo Blaze. Sick. So they can't swap now. 
Gothitelle, like, Shadow Tag is so strong right now. I'm gonna go ahead and swap into a Bomb of Snow, because they shouldn't be able to do anything super strong against me. We'll reset the weather. I kind of almost want to get locked into Freeze Dry. Freeze Dry, I think, just obliterates their team. Yeah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna lock into freeze dry. Yeah, I'm pretty fine with that. A bomb of snow comes in here. Kiram scarf, so it should outspeed both of them. Um, what does what does Seismitoad even do? Yeah, nothing. Just gets Exodia obliterated here. Yeah. Obliterate. We get a good swap here. He sets up the Tailwind. That's a little unfortunate, but we're Scarfed. Uh, he, if he has Sash, that'll get broken here from the Hail. And then we have a Bomb of Snow in. So either has to swap Pelipper out to reset the weather and let something get hit by these two beauties. That has Fake Out, I assume. I'm gonna... Okay, that power. I'm gonna just click Double... Uh, oh, we can't click Double Blizzard, but we'll Freeze Dry here into Pelipper to potentially pick up the KO. Yeah. That's fine. Bellascuda. I'm assuming in the Kiram. Yeah. We still get a big blizzard off, though. Freeze? No freeze, but we deal huge damage. Uh, what is it? Freeze dry? So what's his, what's his play here? Um... I'm going to switch to Energy Ball, hit here, and I'm just going to Freeze Dry into the slot that I think he's going to swap Pelipper into. I mean, I feel like he doesn't have a choice. So, like, this is just a super unfortunate game for him. Yeah, I'm not protecting, dude. <laughs> Don't worry. Oh, CC? I didn't know it had CC. That's a little unfortunate. We still have Weather Control, though. I'll keep the Hail. So we lose Kyurem, which kind of sucks. But uh, we're definitely gonna pick up a second KO here on their on their real attacker. We brought Zapdos, right? We'll find out here in a second. If we bring Zapdos, I think you just like click surrender, and then we can go into a third game. Maybe he forgot he couldn't swap. No, I guess it makes sense. Like I could have just over predicted into the close combat. But yeah, we just have Zapdos. And now we have Water Weather Ball Zapdos. <laughs> uh, so yeah, so the Zapdos is Weather Ball. Um, I could have Hurricane, which would suck. I think I'm pretty fine with swapping in Gothitelle here. Uh, that thing definitely has Volt Absorb, though. Forgot about that. Um, yeah, we'll just Weather Ball. I should have probably just detected, but it's fine. We'll swap in Goth. Faint. Probably into Goth to tell slot. Yeah, he's gonna hurricane. There's no way. Yeah. I'm curious if we could have taken that. I feel like we could have. Voided the attack. Is it bright powder? Weather ball's 100%, I thought. Uh, I'm gonna swap in a bomb now. This is ice now. So I'm gonna fire it into Raichu. I'm surprised they're both... Oh, Tailwind was up. That's right. I'm like, how are they so much faster? They're down to two. I feel like we have advantage, but I don't think the game's over yet. Like, they could get, like, a lucky crit and just really come back. Alright, so this powers down and makes the hurricane miss. Ideally. Yeah, we're faster. Never mind. It, it has to be Bright Powder. A bomb snow avoids. Yeah, they set a tailwind again. Dude, that's super aggravating. Luckily, it's just like dying to hail. <laughs> and I can't, and I can't launch thunderbolt. Um, we can't just blizzard, I guess. Can't thunder wave either. Yeah, I just have the weather ball and pray that I eventually hit one of these. Yeah, he surrendered. Yeah, it was just a matter of time. They couldn't do the damage. He needed that. Hur he needed like to land a hurricane. It might KO. I'm pretty bulky. 
and then yeah i don't even know <laughs> well let me know what you guys think down below like i said if we hit uh 30 likes on the video for the comeback here in vgc i'll go ahead and post the paste as well as the um the rental code down below and on twitter so make sure to follow me there and probably on instagram too i think i used to play, post it on instagram it's been a minute but thank you guys so much for tuning in i hope you enjoyed and uh you know as always catch you later